Hello everyone, I'm Majorvel, welcome to my channel. This week I teach you to make this beautiful girl dress designed by me. I hope you like it. Let's make a square neck with 25 front points, 25 and 25 sleeves and 13 and 13 back. In each corner of the square we will make one double crochet, two chains, one double crochet. In all the rounds we will increase in each corner one double crochet, two chains, one double crochet. We started with a chain of 102 chains. 1 round 3 chains 1 double crochet on each chain until you reach 13 double crochet Once we have the 13 double crochet, we will make two chains, one double crochet in the same chain. We will do the 25 double crochet sleeves. We have reached 25, we make 2 chains, 1 double crochet in the same chain. We continue with the 25 of the front. We have the 25 double crochet from the front. We make 2 chains, 1 double crochet in the same chain. We continue with the 25 double crochet sleeves. We already have the double crochet 25 of the sleeve. We make 2 chains, 1 double crochet in the same chain. We finished with the 13 double crochet back. Two round four chains. Skip one stitch, one double crochet. One chain, 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 skip one stitch, one double crochet. Two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One chain, one double crochet in the next stitch. One chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet. 
We continue to the next corner. One chain, one double crochet. Two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One chain, one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet. We continue to the next corner. One chain, one double crochet. Two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One chain, one double crochet. We continue to the next corner. One chain, one double crochet. Two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One chain, one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch, 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 one double crochet. Join one end with the other. with slip stitch. Three round two chains. One double crochet in each chain. We will arrive at the corner. One double crochet, two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One double crochet in each chain. We will arrive at the corner. One double crochet, two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One double crochet in each chain. We will arrive at the corner. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Increasing in each corner one double crochet, two chains, one double crochet. Finish round with slip stitch.
four round four chains. Skip one stitch one double crochet. One chain, 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 one double crochet. Two chains, one double crochet in the corner. One chain, one double crochet. One chain, skip one stitch, one double crochet. We will work with this sequence intercalating around all double crochet, one round, one double crochet, one chain. We will increase in each corner, one double crochet, two chains, one double crochet. We will work for 9 rounds. Let's join the front with the back. We work until we reach the corner. When we get to the corner, skip the sleeve. We continue until we reach the other corner. When we get to the corner, skip the sleeve. Continue to completed the round. We worked for four more rounds. We started the skirt. Five chains. Three double crochet together.
A chains. We count five chains, four slip stitch. Three double crochet together. Two chains. One double crochet. Two chains. Three double crochet together. Eight chains. We count five chains, four slip stitch. Three double crochet together. Two chains, one double crochet, continue sequence until the end of the round, finish round with slip stitch. Two round five chains, one double crochet. Three chains. Jump to the stem with slip stitch. As seen in the video. In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet. Three chains and slip stitch.
We made the petal In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch We have already made the flower Behind the flower we will make two chains We are hooked with a slip stitch behind the flower Three chains One double crochet Two chains One double crochet Three chains Jump to the stem with slip stitch As seen in the video In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet Three chains and slip stitch
In the middle of the stem, three chains, two double crochet. Three chains and slip stitch. We have already made the flower. Behind the flower we will make two chains. We are hooked with a slip stitch behind the flower. Three chains. One double crochet, two chains, one double crochet. Continue with the sequence until the end of the round. We finished round with slip stitch. We work the round in blue just like the one round. Three chains, two double crochet together. Eight chains. We count five chains, four slip stitch. Three double crochet together. Two chains. One double crochet behind the flower. Two chains. Three double crochet together. Continue sequence until the end of the round. It's a very easy point. 
You only have two rounds, we will repeat and change the color of the flowers you like. We will do a round in blue of stems. A round of flowers to reach the desired length. We work for 15 rounds. We finished the dress with a round in blue without stem. Three double crochet together, two chains, three double crochet together. I hope you liked the tutorial. Thank you very much for seeing me. Thank you very much for following me. I'll wait for you next Monday with another tutorial.